Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided I was gonna do a haul because I did receive some packages in the mail. So the hubby was so nice enough and he picked them up for me. And just wanted to point out if you guys are feeling this hot pink vibe that I have going on, I did record this earlier today. So that video will be up, I wanna say sometime this week. Or maybe next week i don't know because i'm trying to time out like when i want to upload videos because i don't want to upload all my content right away but if you guys prefer that and you want me to do so let me know and i'll be more than happy to but yeah let's just jump right into this haul this haul consists of my most prized possessions which is Ray Dunn. I love Ray Dunn. Um, I know you probably like what if you see my page i do have a lot of Ray Dunn videos on there and it's because it just, it just makes me so happy. Like, I'm not gonna lie. I started looking into Ray Dunn when I first got here and I started purchasing offline and through Facebook pages that I added myself into. So I honestly created such a big collection now and I'm thankful to my mom, my sister, and my best friend Tanya that have contributed to my addiction. <laughs> So I kind of just want to tell you that yes, you'll see some redone finally. Um, there wasn't a lot of things lately that have been catching my eye and right before the whole quarantine and stuff back at back in the States, I was able to snag up some things and I was really happy I was able to do so because one of them is something new. It's this over here. And so I was really excited and it was something that I needed for Enzo. So I'm gonna start off with my Ray Dunn things and then we'll just go into the other two items that I have. So I do wanna say this haul is probably gonna be really short because it's not many things. So yes. <laughs> the first item I had purchased a long time ago and I just never unpacked it yet because initially it was intended for my vanity. So literally a weekend prior to us going and quarantine in Italy, my friend and I, Annabelle, we were gonna go to Ikea and we were gonna do a big like sweep through ikea because i needed a vanity and it's something that i've been really wanting really bad because back at home i had a vanity and i just couldn't bring that with me so the hubby was going to create a whole vanity for me unfortunately obviously i cannot go to ikea so i had ordered this already and i was pretty mad because i was like no but it's okay i had put it aside and then i had said i would just record it later on first the first item is this things holder so it has this right here and then it has the three openings and of course it's ceramic absolutely love it it's so sturdy so i was thinking that i would put this on the vanity with like brushes up here and maybe lip glosses or like liners and stuff like that on here i'm not sure how much this one was and I can probably look on my emails, so I'll let you guys know, but this one had been consistently on the TJ Maxx site, and I just thought I would just pick it up now, and luckily I did. <laughs> the next item was one of the last things I had ordered, and I was also happy about it because I was like, alright, I'll just put it aside when I get it, and that is the favorite things, and it's another three, like a tri holder, and I thought this was super cute because I could also put it with brushes or any other things that I have that I want to put here like mascaras and stuff like that so I thought that was really cute and if I find the price I will put it somewhere around here and I thought that was really nice because I do want to go with like neutral colors on my vanity and since it's like a neutral cream I thought it'd be perfect the last Ray Dunn item is for Edzo and I didn't get one for Dino just because Dino when we first had moved here I had purchased a big food canister for him and I absolutely love his but it's just really big and when we got Enzo obviously they were eating two different types of food so we couldn't mix anything so we kind of held off on getting Enzo a canister and then just having the bag open there in our in the like closet room downstairs i just don't like that and i just prefer getting something and i was contemplating on getting something else for it because i was like i don't want another big one even though it's great like it was it's absolutely it's like one of my favorite things ever like if i had known about this way before i would have gotten one a long time ago but i had seen through social media that ray dunn was releasing releasing canisters for pets and i was like yes and right before they ended up shutting the websites this came on 
and this is humongous like look at that and it's so cute it says good dog on there and i was so happy i got this let me see what it says yeah it's just like their little pet collection then you open it i do have my other item in here i'll take that out <laughs> so yeah it's really big so i figured we would just put in and so spoon in here and if we find the price i will put it somewhere here I don't know if this will be back on the site once things get back to normal. Hopefully they would because my friend was trying to get one and they canceled her order and I felt so bad because I was like, no, she's getting a puppy. So I was like, oh my God, you have to get him this. So I'm really bummed out, but hopefully it gets back on there once they open the sites up again so she can snag it up too for her little pup. But I thought it was so adorable and I just love that it's a plain like white, nothing crazy because Dino's is a clear white one. Well, clear top white. <laughs> but yeah, guys, so I thought that was super adorable. All right, the next item was the last item I actually purchased in TJ Maxx. And I, contempl and I contemplated on whether I wanted to get it in two different colors. And then I was like, you know what, let me get it in this because I had already had in mind that I was going to get the Zara sandals that you would have seen in my Zara haul that I just posted this week. If you have not seen it, go right after it, see it because I'm going to link it up here. You guys have no excuses we are quarantined just go support your girl <laughs> so yeah so i was gonna get it in black first and then i was like no like they had it in white and i was like let me get it in white and i was never one to really like white shoes like sandals like i don't know and then i saw these and i was like oh these are really cute like they're nice it's like a vibe <laughs> so i had to snag them i had to get them and they're from madden girl and let me tell you they shipped this out like in the most biggest box ever i was like damn did they send me like another pair that i didn't ask for i was like i'll take it and i tried these on already and they look gorgeous so this is a sandal it has like this little spikes on it and it has like a really good like cushion base like, let me show you guys two of them at first i was like well if i don't want them i'm sure i could just sell it on the wives page <laughs> i'm sure one of them will snag it up but i actually really like these like Honestly, and they weren't not expensive. If I find the price for it, I will put it somewhere here. And they were on the page for a while, and they had them in black too. So I don't know. I might, I might get these in black too because I just think they're so nice and they're so comfy. I already tried them on. If I decide, I'll put like a little foot clip here for any foot fetish lovers out there. <laughs> but yeah, I thought these are adorable and they're comfy and they're a perfect size. These are an eight. So I don't I don't feel like I need to size up or anything like I have mentioned in my Zara shoes. So I think these are super nice. So the last product literally was like an oopsie daisy. And an oopsie daisy in the fact that I had signed up for these shoes a long time ago I should say. And I can believe I forgot. And then I see it's like an Adidas confirmation and I was like, no. <laughs> I had just purchased a new pair of Yeezys. Yeah. I was devastated, but I thought, well, if I don't like them, I can just return them. So they actually came in super fast. And these are the Yeezy Boost 350 V2. And this color. I'm trying to think about what color this was. It's not a sand color. I don't know. So I actually really wanted the earth tone ones. Like the brown ones. I thought those were gorgeous. I signed up for that one. Didn't get it. Um, and then they recently released like the all black ones I think again. I didn't sign up for it. And then I know they're releasing another black one with reflective. So I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll sign up for those instead. And if I get those, then I'll pick those and I'll just return these. But honestly, I don't know. I'm going to see. I don't even know if you're able to return these shoes. But this is actually my third pair of Yeezys. I do have two already. If I get the pictures, I will insert them here. I'm not gonna go get them right now <laughs> but these 
I was really worried. I was not gonna like them just because they do have like the orange on them and I already have a pair with that. But this is what the shoe looks like. So I actually really like this color because it's like a neutral color. I could have done without this to be honest, but that's how the shoe is and this is reflective which i absolutely love i think it's so nice i like lost it when i saw it because i had briefly seen a post and i was like oh crap they're reflective and yeah so i'm super excited for these i'm definitely gonna keep them so yeah and but so i noticed the orange on this one is kind of like a more like like a toned down orange <laughs> my other ones are brighter orange here with the little swift thingy with a little thingy here i'll put a picture of it so yeah so i got these and these are a size five and a half if i'm not mistaken yeah five and a half i absolutely adore them and i absolutely love yeezys um i think they are now a little bit overpriced at first like the hype and stuff but i honestly love the shape of the shoe i love the way the shoe feels these are so comfortable i wear my yeezys constantly it's literally like my weekend shoes because i could just dress them up with anything um of course when i'm trying to get more senora like i do not wear yeezys unless we're gonna be like shopping but just depending on my outfit i really like to wear my yeezys i think they're so cute and yeah i'm getting my husband on the bandwagon because he has a pair and i think he might want to get the black ones so yes, this is the biggest purchase of this haul, but I'm really happy. And you can kind of see like the little reflection here. Happy camper. Yes, guys, that was it for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, please keep in mind, I ordered this way before <laughs> everything. So I'm not out here. I'm not out here online shopping, even though I low-key am because your girl is bored. And I honestly have become addicted to the Amazon favorites videos obsessed with them and i just found someone that like literally does all these like pins of all these like amazon favorites and oh my god this girl is amazing like she has the best amazon like favorites and i'm not gonna tell you who it is because you guys might want to take everything i know i need to order first and then i'll share it jake <laughs> i'm just kidding if i find her name i'll put it somewhere here i definitely recommend you check her out she don't know who i am but i think her stuff is perfect like perfect she has everything categorized organized and yeah it's great but let me stop rambling because this is it i have another video to record and i don't want this to be too long but once again guys if you enjoy watching my hauls please give me a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe leave me a comment down below what was your favorite item in this haul i am so excited if you have clicked on this video and you've subscribed thank you so much it means the world to me and i love you guys a lot and i'm just gonna stop rambling bye